to what people think or say on Facebook. Oh, we're gonna give him a ticket. We're taking him to spend. No, no, we we're trying to get everybody out safe and get get traffic moving. And um, yeah, that's our goal. So. That's, that's what we're here for. No, that's awesome. So wait a minute. So you just debunked something here is that people always say that, you know, the, the CHP pulls out as drivers and at the top we get a ticket. So you know, yeah. we know 100% yeah. now and that's not true. <laughs> no, that's so no. funny. No. Oh, no. Saying that. Yeah. Something like that. We just, we'll get them out and get them on the way. And, and the driver, honestly, they're just happy to get off the hill and, and, and be on the way because nobody wants to be stuck over Don or something. <laughs> What's going on, Mother Truckers? Uh, please email me at mothertruckernews at gmail.com. If you have anything that can help truck drivers out, we're always here just trying to do our best just to help out the community. And I've had probably about 100 truck drivers send me out links to this. And one truck driver says that he was actually stuck the other day and the CHP helped pull them out. And so I want to give props to the CHP for this. CHP Truckee, uh, they have a Facebook channel, and they've been posting a lot of neat stuff here. This is the one that I'm talking about that I've been getting links about. Is Let me put this up here. It's getting a little tricky out there. You know it's a mess when we have to use three patrol vehicles to pull a big rig out. Westbound I-80 uh, is currently uh, being held in Truckee due to multiple spinouts over Donner Summit. Yeah, I mean, they're doing everything they can to help out truck drivers the last few days. And I just thought that was super awesome. And it's, it's just great to see, you know, a lot of times, you know, law enforcement gets a lot of um, crap for inspections, DOTs, and, you know, shutting down owner operators. But sometimes there might be a reason for that, right? But I just want to show you that right there. Let's actually call them and see what's going on. Uh, I just want to thank them because truck drivers have been asking me and telling me about this, and they thought it was a great thing. So let's check this out right here. California High Patrol Truckee. Hi, how are you doing today? Good, how's it going? Good, good. Uh, I just want to let you know, you know, I, I do trucking like YouTube type videos, sir, and I've had so many truck drivers send me links of uh, you know your three patrol uh, uh cars pulling out truck drivers from uh donald oh, yeah. area the other day yeah and uh -huh. they, we just wanted to say thank you for that because i just thought that was so awesome yeah no we we do it all the time i don't think people we don't we started recently putting a lot of videos with us helping out and trying to not just us caltrans ended up helping us give an extra push on that on that uh big rig but we ourselves and, and Caltrans every winter we're out here um, trying to get people out our, our biggest goal you know um, you know obviously what people think or say on Facebook oh we're gonna give them a ticket we're taking them to spend no no we we're trying to get everybody out safe and get get traffic moving and um, yeah that's our goal so that's that's what we're here for no that's awesome so wait a minute so you just debunked something here is that people always say that you know the, the CHP pulls out as drivers and at the top we get a ticket so you know, yeah, we know 100% yeah. now that's not true. <laughs> no, that's so no. funny. No, oh, thank no, oh no, yeah, something like that. We just we'll get them out and get them on the way. And, and the driver, honestly, they're just happy to get off the hill and, and, and be on the way because nobody wants to be stuck over Don or something. <laughs> no, appreciate it, appreciate it. Now, the last thing I was going to ask you, sir, is um, how many trucks were stuck the other day because it said a couple of spin outs with the big rigs. Oh gosh! If I look through the log again, uh, if we were to, if we were to put every every incident that happens every it's it's we it's just impossible. Um, on that video, there was one actually. Well, actually, no, you can't see on the video. There was another video that one of the officers shot. There was another one behind him that was also stuck. I think we had either four, four, four or five that were stuck that um, in that vicinity within a I'm going to say a three to four mile range. Wow, no, um, that, but that's, that's not in, that's not including that's not including other vehicles that we had as well throughout the Truckee area, not just on the 80, but our other areas that we respond to, like, you know, on the state, state routes and whatnot. We, it, when it falls apart, it falls apart. <laughs> I hear you. So it sounds like it, it can be uh, uh, 20, 30, 40 <laughs> a month uh, during um, the winter season. <laughs> 
Oh yeah, oh yeah. Like I said, if we were out there videotaping, we just we you know our goal is to get it out when the officers get a chance, either myself or somebody else on the field to get a quick shot, cool, good to go. But for the most part, we're just trying to hustle and bustle and trying to get people out uh, unstuck and get them on their way. No, that's excellent. You know, the guys that come up here, they know. And like I said, you know, looking through some of the comments and you know some of the guys that've been through here that drive routinely through the area, they know that we're out here. You know, ourselves and Cal- Caltrans. You know, Caltrans has a pusher as well specifically to help out when we can't when it's too much of a load they'll come out with the pusher and and and, and they'll help out so I, I i'm not gonna just give myself our our csp trophy credit you know caltrans does an amazing job we, we work great with them up here and um again like i said our, our main goal is you know get they get these guys going uh get them safe get them pulled out and and on the way and not what people think we're taking them somewhere to give them a ticket or inspect them no 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 we're trying to get them home safe or back to the route safe you know no, that's great. You know, no, I appreciate it. You know, I, I just, we, I use this channel just to highlight everything in trucking and sometimes, yeah, you know, law enforcement gets a bad rap because, you know, you know, out of service tickets, things like that. But, you know, what, there are situations or reasons for that. And in this situation, I would, I'm glad and I would love to highlight you guys in a positive route. So it, it's just great. And I, I appreciate you so much. And, you know, who knows, one of these days I'm in Miami, I need to jump out there and maybe I could be on your guys' patrol car helping pull up. Everything. Yeah, absolutely. You know, no, thank you so much for your time. And I appreciate you actually yeah, letting me use this conversation uh, to let people know that, hey, y'all are the good guys trying to do the right thing, you know. <laughs> yep. Yep. It, you know, like I said, if you're out there doing the right thing, trying to do do your route properly, do everything right. And, and you know, I, we understand sometimes the conditions are like most of the time is because, you know, the conditions are not great up there. And uh, unfortunately, you'll get stuck. And, and that's why we're there. You know, we're there to help out. So, um, yeah, we uh, we definitely appreciate those guys that are out there working every day to get our stuff, you know, from point A to point B. So they're they're a great, you know, lifeline to get all this everything moving. So no yep, amazing well. amazing yeah i just had to call in you know i'm sure you don't get enough you get enough calls when bad things happen when, but when good things happen not enough people call in so you know have a great day sir you too take care have yep. a good one bye-bye bye-bye mother truckers all i gotta say is man you know they can't all be bad you know especially in this situation uh, i thought that was amazing that they were just pulling out truck drivers and it sounds like all winter long, they do it all winter long. And no, they are not ticketing people. So, you know, the truckers, comment down below.